before box shop there were a lot of things that we didn't know in terms of running our own businesses branding how serious that is as well as costing if you were making money or not so now we've improved on that uh, the only thing that has been lacking with me is the technicalities remember i'm from I'm from the management background, I'm, I'm a strategist by profession, so I understand the business side of things, but the side that I didn't understand was the value chain, the technicalities of fashion, uh, the sourcing of material, how does material become material, that's where I was making because I didn't have time to study, and with my partner, which is the one who focuses on that side of things, but with the bookshop, at least I get to know his frustration when he said this material won't work here, and I I get to be part uh, in his shoes uh, during that process and understanding the value chain. Incubation and going through to the box shop, um, I had a bit of knowledge on how to run a business. But as I was mentioning, the compliance and all of that, that I wasn't quite familiar with at times. So I've learned a lot from it. And yeah, I wasn't too bad, but yeah. I, I knew how to make the clothes, uh, but I, the coming to business-wise, like how to do admin and counting the money, that wasn't, I wasn't good at that. So um, the incubation for box shop, the box shop really helped with that. The admin, the how to do my books, especially because as a designer, you can take it for granted. Didn't have much of experience. Um, in terms of like making money, we, it used to be just from hand to mouth most of the time. We didn't know like saving for the business, um, other things like exploring other things as much as like uh, we're doing now, going to markets, knocking on doors in terms of like retail part of things. So now we slowly getting better at that. It, it, it is without doubt that uh, COVID has impacted everyone. Because why? Uh, most, if you, you may know that most of our material, they have been shipped outside the, the continent. So now, if that, uh, if COVID happened, it's because of that uh, the trade. So most of our guys were unable to produce the garments for rated seasons, right? That's why we have the delays on, on production, have delays on introducing new ranges. Why? Because of the material not being sourced locally. So, however, you can't say that it's, it's being negative, but it's also given us a, a, bigger, a bigger, uh, better picture in the sense that how do we then ensure that everything is being produced locally from the raw material to the garments that they are, they are produced locally? Because now our, our tempo for uh, localization is only limited to assembly, not necessarily manufacturing. So, but now the COVID has given us to say that then how then can we move? the production of ensuring that you own the value chain. How I found my business, it's picking up and uh, what COVID has taught me is that even though I do bags, people weren't buying expensive bags anymore because financially things weren't going, going, going well. So with our sessions with the box shop, they said look for something else. Venture into something else that could supplement what you're doing so hence i went into these storage bags something reasonable less than 500 rands which slowly kept me going and even now it's it's becoming my bread and butter kind of thing so the business so far is picking up uh, from the covid stress and we are trying to push units uh, and revenue uh, but it's still like a recovery so as you know, when we are injured, you take time to recover. So we are just healing with the process and taking it easy, one step at the time, no rush. And we are building it block by block and making sure that we are fully healed and fully recovered before we can go on full-blown activation and, and going out there. 
Most of the equipment that we have, it's, we got grants from a workshop. Yes, and even now there are some equipment that we're waiting for that we bought from, we got the money from a workshop. We are waiting our branded uh, gazebo as well as a sewing machine, it's coming. So like, um, I was sewing like, it was just a thing that I was teaching myself. So now we will be able to start putting lining in our bags that we do. What we mean by buy local? We mean that if you buy local, the money circulates within the local economy, right? That's why the modern day uh, term is township economy, right? Is to say that just ensure that the money circulates, right? Same applies to buy local. When you buy local, let the money circulate within South Africa before it can go out, but let the let, let the money first circulate with pay. So yes, we are a proud member of SA Good Standing. Hence, we champion the idea of buy local to say that what does buy local mean? Right, all our uh, inventory in the store is proudly SA, right? Producing SA, right? But the only thing that is missing is the, is the sourcing of the material. Say that the box shop is a place where they take you out of your comfort zone and release you to the to the global world, to the global market, because uh, to make money you need to go out there.